What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we are headed to Dallas Vintage Toys. Myself and Nate Simmons, we went to a toy show last weekend and then we went directly to DVT to see what they got. And guys, they were stacked. Yeah, yeah. Got 250 on them. That's cool. The eyes are Friday sale, so we're we're wow. still. Got all these notes here. Uh, yes. So he said he thinks it's a prototype, bootleg prototype ah. from Mexico, which is still really cool though. I didn't know a whole lot about the Mexico ones to you guys. I mean, yeah, they got some some crazy ones for sure. They're definitely sought after. Scratch the cat. Got some rainbow sectors. Oh, look at that. Nice. Oh, centurions. That's a good price, dude. 50. Yeah. What with the figure? Yeah, that's a really good price. Even the Rambo's look good too. Mm -hmm. Get this dude right here. This McLeod. Hey, Dad. Look at this dude. Yeah. Wow. It's heavy. That's a nice piece. It's Thundercats. Super rare pieces. Is that the uh, original Battle Cat? I think so. Wow, very nice. Tendril right there. Oh man, that's crazy. Uh, I know for the well, Shira, she doesn't have the shield, but she has the sword. Yeah, I think I have the shield. That's why I was like. I think that's the original, that big gem yeah. for Battle Cat. They just reuse that mold. Look at that. Look at that. That's nice, dude. Sound really good prices, man. Got these slender cats up here. Oh. So, this is the sales rag. That's $150 for a case of the cake starter spawn. Dude, that's a good price. Oh, that's the modern right there. $150, yeah? Yeah. Wow. So, most of these are like. I think like 10 bucks. There's Cannonball, 10 bucks. Gung Ho, $10. Yeah, pretty much. We got these aliens. 20? That's a good price, man. Rhino Alien. I didn't waste price that. 20 bucks, dude. Not bad. Super sevens. Oh yeah, dude. I can't. Look at all these gems. Wow. Man, I always wanted that X Y T. Oh man. Look at all this stacked. Got these dudes up here. Just that's everywhere. Like, that's the only two I want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The well, killer well. Mochu section over here. Demon skeletal. Stocked. Oh, oh, look at that. Freaking um. Uh, yeah, but what's the line? That's uh, Zoe. Is that Twitch? It looks like that, dude. Mm -hmm. Check out this Brave Star. Great it. And all these dudes. 30 30. Wow. All great it. Then you got Fort Curium down here. Go over here. Got some superpowers. Secret Wars. Some, some hay mans down there. Look at that. And some Tron. More um, superpowers. 
Take out these dudes down here. All right, so they got a bunch of these like Ghostbusters bundled up. We got some 18 figures up here. Three of them for 25. Three for 25. She's a little harder to find. Yeah, Robocop. Some more Ghostbusters. Draco. Then we got some Remco, Karate Kid. Got Miyagi and Daniel Sun. 40. Look at these dudes down here. That's so sick. His old booties. Here's Crease. Where's that 40 for the two pack? I got some um, superpowers in here. Here's a bag of superpowers. Let's see what's the price on these. 40 bucks for all this. It's a pretty good deal. And here's some games. Some Nintendo. Got these dudes hanging out. More bootlegs. And look at this. Forty bucks for the uh, for the pack. Got some Bucky O'Hare. Oh, but his hands missing. Dude, look at this bag of these words. I mean, uh, that'll be. <laughs> I mean, yeah, ten dollars, ten dollars a piece. Yeah. Wow. Especially if the reflector is actually still worth. It's another bag. Dude, and another bag. <laughs> and another bag. And that's cool. They have the accessories bagged up too. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Huh. These are getting harder to find too. The Mighty Ducks. Mm -hmm. Was complete. Sweet yeah. sharks too. Oh, dude. Yeah. Got this dude. Got that guy. They actually have the cards. Yeah. Yeah, they're clean too. Wow. Look at these. Got some carded Captain Planet. Check these out. Instant sludge. Then over here we got little Dracula, all carded. All right, so we just got some uh, Star Trek shirts on card, hanging out. Forty bucks. That's a good deal. And then we got the uh, tune. I think yeah, that's the re-release, twenty twenty-two. We got Adam's family down here. Like Simpsons. Got some towels from the Crypt Keeper. Look at those. Get down there. Flintstones right there. Okay, so I'm having a little dilemma. I'm looking at Centurions. I already got one waiting for me. But there's this Rambo in the tank that I, or in his Jeep that I showed earlier. It's pretty clean. I don't know which one I'm going to go with. Think Centurions? Let's see. I don't know. As you can see, Dallas Vintage Toys was packed with the vintage goodness. It was really, really tough to figure out what I was going to pick up because I was like, oh, look, they got this, they got this, and the prices were on point. And I just wanted to thank those guys for um, stocking up the shop, having great inventory. So thank you, DBT. Let's get on to the pickup. So I was going back and forth if I should get this Centurions. This is Jake Rockwell. And um, there was also the Rambo uh, Jeep that was pristine condition. I think it was like 60 or 70 bucks, but I ended up going with the uh, Jake Rockwell and the detonator. Now this is not complete. As you can see, I need to get the other missile over here and another gun or two on the side. Missiles. I believe only spent $50 on this piece. It's really tough to find Centurions in the Wild 1, but 2 with most of their pieces for their ships. 
is even a greater challenge. So I got Centurion's Jake Rockwell with the detonator. This next pickup was definitely my favorite one of the day. This is Max Ray with his depth charger. So check it out. Once again, there are a few pieces missing, which I can totally get, but Max Ray comes with his helmet. As you can see right there, you take him out and he is ready for action. I really love how Kenner made these guys or this line. Basically, you could put the pieces anywhere you want it to, make your own monstrosity and have fun with it. So Max Ray with the depth charger was my final pickup and I believe he was $69.99 at Dallas Vintage Toys. So guys, if you're in the area, check out DBT. They stock the shelves. It is freaking crazy. I'm going to get back up there as soon as I can. And guys, until next time, peace.